heard about it from a senior in one of my classes and it just spoke to me. It was something that I was really drawn to because we get this incredible opportunity to impact the lives of other students on our campus and I knew that that was right for me and that was something I wanted to do. I chose to become a peer mediator because I wanted to give students on campus an alternate route to solving conflict rather than going through adults and instead coming to their peers. Growing up, I've always been a very empathetic person and I love helping people and so when a close friend of mine told me about the peer mediation program, I knew that it was such a perfect fit for me and I knew I wanted to join. So, I think Peer mediation has really impacted me in understanding conflict, not seeing conflict in a negative way, but really approaching it head on so I could value my relationships better. It's helped me because watching other people and helping other people go through their conflicts has also taught me the importance of listening and realizing how much in my own conflicts I need to listen and hear other people's perspectives. I feel like I approach life in a new way. I approach conversations in a different way and my friends and family now come to me for advice and help. So, hi. Hi. Hi, tell us your name. My name's Heather Schoen. And what role do you play here? Well, I'm a counselor at Palisades Charter High School and I coordinate the peer mediation program. So, when did the program start? Maybe about 15 years ago we started in down the restorative practices pathway with um, restorative circles and then we started doing peer mediation about seven years ago. And um, how long have you been with the program? I was the founder of the program. How many students are currently in the program? We have about 26 mediators at any given time. Right now we have 46. We have a big group because a lot are graduating so we've trained a little more with help from KMC and their funding. And we do a peer mediation, generally referred by the Dean's Office, with issues between two students where we can help them resolve it and put them back in the classroom. The most gratifying part of my job is really to watch the students resolve the conflicts and to see our students so successfully help them navigate it. I used to do the mediations myself and the kids took a long time to warm up to the idea of working with me and know that I'm not going to get them in trouble. But with the students, they jump right in and get to the issue and resolve the conflict quickly. I really love our collaboration with GAMC. The money that they've given us has helped us to train new students every year, provide lanyards for our Pali Beast Posse. They all wear these lanyards. It allows their students to leave classroom. The school really respects what they do. It is one of the best things I've ever done in my career to have this peer mediation program. So I'm really grateful. Absolutely. Traditionally, when a student gets in trouble and there's a conflict, they're, they're suspended, they're sent home, they continue on social media to keep the conflict going, and when we can go in and solve the problem with the students, they go back to class where the learning can happen. And that's the most important reason we're here as educators. They can learn to resolve their conflicts, then they can be more successful in the future. It's something unpredictable, but in the end is right. I hope you have the time of your life. Thank you, KMC, for everything you do. Thank you, KMC!